Hello everyone. LD Player is a free Android emulator for PC that allows you to experience Android apps and games smoothly on your computer. With performance optimization and support for keyboard and mouse, LD Player offers an enhanced gaming and app experience on a larger screen. However, the standout feature of LD Player lies in its ability to emulate multiple virtual machines and control them simultaneously using multi-control. This is extremely convenient for those who want to run Android games or participate in the recent trend of cryptocurrency airdrops. Today, I will guide you on how to set up, optimize virtual machines, and manage multiple virtual machines at the same time. First, download LD Player and install it on your computer. The latest version is LD Player 9, which supports up to Android 9. After downloading, proceed to install it on your system. After the installation is complete, open LD Player. You can install apps either from the Play Store or by using external APK files. I won't go into detail about this process. Now, let's focus on setting up virtual machines and optimizing them so that your computer can run them smoothly and stably. Click on LD Multiplay, then press Add Instance. Select the Android 9 version and click OK to proceed. Click on the settings icon of the virtual machine you just created. Adjust the resolution size of the emulator based on your usage. If you want to use it in landscape mode, select tablet, and for phone-like emulation, choose mobile. Set the resolution to the lowest option for better performance. In the core section, select one core if your computer has low specifications. Otherwise, choose two cores for better performance. Allocate 1 to 2 GB of RAM, depending on whether the app you want to run on the emulator has higher requirements or not. This ensures smoother operation based on your system's capacity. In the FPS section, lower the value to the minimum for better performance. Then, click Save, and you're done. You can create more virtual machines as needed. If your computer has good specifications, you can run 20-30 emulators at the same time for enhanced multitasking. Now, to use the synchronized control feature for multiple emulators at once, it's best to adjust each emulator window to the same size to ensure synchronization. You can also combine this with AutoClick for better efficiency. Click on the three dots icon, then select Synchronizer, choose the virtual machines you want to sync, and press Start. Now, you can enjoy this amazing feature to control multiple emulators simultaneously. The synchronization control feature of LD Player allows users to control multiple virtual machines simultaneously, enhancing gaming performance and saving time with automation capabilities through AutoClick. When all emulator windows are the same size, users can easily perform simultaneous actions. This feature is flexible for various applications, helping to manage and optimize performance according to usage needs. Regarding resource consumption, RAM, and CPU, the three tabs operate very smoothly on my low-spec computer. You can see that the RAM and CPU usage of the three virtual machines running simultaneously is still very efficient. In my opinion, if you cannot afford professional software like GPM, then LD Player is the best choice for gamers and those involved in crypto airdrops. Thank you for watching the video, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. If you found this helpful, please subscribe to support me.